previously on the season. Time for some tutoring. It's snapping school. It's like stretching for the first time since the last time you were mic'd up. Just like the last time I was mic'd up. Pretty good. Juice, as we call it, on the uh, on the offensive side of the ball. Well, he yeah, because he's always drinking sugar all the time and eating sugar. So he's well, he always has his sugar rushes. So he's uh yeah, he's always just fired up and. He's just like a little kid out there. Well, Lane's missing his top targets today. How do they overcome not having these guys? It's going to be a long game. It's going to be a million plays, OK? Take one snap at a time. Put the last snap behind you. If you're on the sidelines, you're locked in, ready to go. Play action. Fires toward the end zone. It's going to be caught and held on. Touchdown, Ole Miss. There's the kick, and they're going to bring it out of the end zone. He's going to try it to the 20, to the 25, the sidelines to the 30. Sidesteps the man to the 40, to the 45. Still got blockers. He's to the 40. He's to the 30. He's gone to the 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Something you want to say? I'm good, bro. Man, that's how you feel today? Push up. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what it is. I think they think I look cute today. That might be what it is. Hey, people. How y'all doing today? It's going to be a good day today, man. Hey, did y'all know, fun fact, me and AJ roommates, freshman roommates, year. Freshman year. Look, we had a Obviously. twin bed and we shared it all no, freshman no, 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 we didn't. No, no. We didn't do that. If anybody wants to know, I was the better roommate out of the two. Absolutely better looking, you, absolutely. We shared a bathroom? Dirtiest thing I've ever seen. What? Oh, dude. No! Hey, it'll work. Sip JC Red! Red! Sip JC Red! Red! S-I! S-I! Ah! Should have been a pick. Yep. But he said he got the best hand in the second day. Hey, don't put that on there, please. No, it's on there. Please don't put that. It's on there. Please don't put that on there. There's a lot more stuff on there, too. Nah. Ball game! Ball game! Ball game! Ball game! Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I, tell, hey, tell they show up when it matters. Tell matter. how many picks you got. I got three of them. Ooh, three, three of them. Oh, you cocky with it. No, I ain't cocky. He cocky with it. <laughs> With the departure of All-American receiver Elijah Moore, Coach Lane Kiffin left no stone unturned to fill the void ahead of the Outback Bowl. Fun fact, these are Elijah Moore shorts. I thought if I wore them, I would kind of resemble him a little bit, you know? We'd look the same, so therefore we play the same. Give me the rock. <clears throat> you can tell Coach Kiffin's really a cold weather guy. He loves it. Psych. <laughs> Psych. Yeah, not a big, not a big cold weather guy. I'm gonna give him a hug too. Yeah, I'll get that on video when I do that. Get the hug on video. He, he's a big hug guy. Some yoga places call this downward facing dog. Did yoga in high school with the baseball team? Shout out OG. Let's go. Under my arm, my gym, my biceps are so big, you know. Yeah, even there like. I'm gonna bust out of it. Oh. <laughs> here, come here, Bob. What's up, brother? See my boy Merrick up there? Look, smile out of us right there. Look, Rebel Nation, we'd like to give a warm welcome to Mr. Luke Altmeyer, the Glad new guy on here, the man. block. We'd like to be the first guy to do so. So, welcome to 
Oh, I don't know if he signed the video consent form yet. Can I get a thumbs down, thumbs up if he if he's good? I, iffy. Yeah. We, we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get, there. We'll get you on the season. Don't worry. Get some camera time. Put it going for the sneak attack. Yeah, Trump. Excuse me. Just gotta, came to give Coach a hug. How are we doing, Coach? How are you doing? COVID. <laughs> <laughs> Fun fact also, I'm gonna get to wear a sleeve because quarterback, you can't wear a sleeve. Ball handling issues, but playing the receiver this week, so that's that. Speaking of spider, watch this Spider Man hands. Sticky. Ooh. Yeah. I'm out of here. Yeah. Give me the rock. <laughs> ah, dang! <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> Remember, like, I want to get on his outside hip. Push the, yeah, yeah, get close to the so I block. Stay, I stay right on his outside hip, I'm right here. So that guy ever attempted to stay right there. Yeah. But if I stay on the outside of the hip, that guy should go here to the last second. Cut it up. The ground and come right off, right off the wall. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, I had you. So stair step him and step flat now. He wasn't mad, he was, there was a. Tampa player, middle of the field. But he grabbed you. He caught me. He caught you, so once you do that, drop yourself back flat and you get over. Nice. Let's go. Learn it. Good day of practice, huh? Here we go. Finn. Noggin. Dude. <laughs> Uh, you know, get a little, a little snack, you know, to get ready for these Indiana Hoosiers. I don't know what a Hoosier is, so that's good. Good thing we'll beat them about 30. This is my last night of snack. Land knows, and let's just eat everything there is to offer. So I like to go for the quesadillas. You know? like, nothing on the grilled cheese sandwiches, but quesadillas is where my heart lies, you know, from Texas. So I'll take one chicken. And one stick, case of these. The pressure is great. Yeah, I'm taking it. Let me show you how to do it. What is that? Straight these babies in here. People don't know you got to eat the spaghetti and the mashed potatoes. You got to mix them together. I'm trying to tell Coach Durkin it's the best combo you got to eat, man. You got to, y'all got to try it. Y'all got to try it. You know, we got grilled cheese on some Texas toast. Oh, some barbecue chicken sandwich? Oh, no. Steak quesadilla. Gotta go with the steak quesadilla. I have not. Quesadilla. <laughs> a lot of people from Mississippi eat catfish and spaghetti. I like. In Alabama, we do not eat that. Catfish and spaghetti, that's that's two different. How you gonna have two entrees together? That is that is horrible. That is horrible. I'm gonna mess with the steak quesadillas. Steak quesadillas. Hey, what is Steak quesadilla, and I'm probably gonna mess with the barbecue chicken sandwiches. That's that's gonna be the move tonight. Uh, got some steak. You can't never go wrong with steak. You feel me? It's the best thing in the world to me. Might get some quesadillas. I don't know yet. Plotting on it. Gonna get some fruit though. Stay healthy. Oh, but I really want some pineapple. All the pineapple is gone though. Just take me some chips, and banana, and about two plums. Call it a night. All right, bye, it is a beautiful 80 degrees in Tampa, Florida, as we get a matchup between the SEC and the Big Ten. Number 11, Indiana, with just one loss in the season, looking to close their year in style. We in Tampa with it. It's been a start 2020 while with a door. Hey, we ain't been here in about five, six years to a bowl game, and now we found that one. 2021 all year. Hey, one shot, one kill, dog, right? You don't have another opportunity this year. You ain't got another one, right? Look, Christmas was close, you know, all about presents. You never know. Surprises inside the box, man. I might have got some up my sleeve today. 
We'll see if I show it to you. First touchdown, 100%. John Rice Plumley. Hey, I got four. I got John Rice for four today. And not at quarterback. I don't know what position he's playing. Nothing's more important than these next 60 minutes. Nothing. It's all laying on the line right now, right here. Play for your brothers, man. Play for these seniors, guys. Make sure we are fighting our ass off for each other. Set it to the quarterbacks earlier. All the ball games we've been a part of, you know which ones were the most fun? The ones we won. Bottom line, so we get our ass in here and we party our ass off in this locker room as a family together. Every game has ups and downs, just go play the next play, all right? And stay together with everything. Let's put our best game together right now. You guys got it? All right, this is a hell of a deal, man. Great stage, let's go do it. Great chance for guys to step up in this game, all right, that have been waiting all year to make plays, and now you're gonna get to do it. So let's take care of the ball, let's go after the ball, and let's have that game on defense today. Let's have that dominant defensive game. Yeah. When we stop them, when we get turnovers, we just hey, come Jack. to the sideline and expect to do it again. Yeah. And do it again and again yes, and again. All right, let the day be that day. Let's dominate these guys. Win on three, one, two, three. Win. It didn't take long for new faces to shine on the brightest of stages. Corral comes out throwing, plenty of space on that completion and all the way down to the 45 yard line for Jaden Jackson. Corral on play action, goes deep over the middle again, that one's caught by Dontario Drummond, a gain of 34. Corral to throw, near side, got his tight end, it's caught to the 40, to the 45 yard line, that is uh, Casey Kelly, Chad Kelly's brother. Corral has all day and he goes underneath to his running back Parrish. There's a quick look in and in traffic, hauled in there by Mingo. He loses his helmet as he got hit. The helmet flies off, but Jonathan Mingo holding now a nice grab, and the kick is good. And Ole Miss regains the lead. It's six to three, Rebels. With the new pieces fitting nicely into place, Coach Lane Kiffin turned to a familiar face to provide a spark at a different spot. Look, it's tough to play receiver when you're not a receiver, but we'll see. He's an athlete. They're going to find ways to get him the ball in space. Plumlee, the interesting point, he didn't know how to line up as a wide receiver when they first put him out there. Going to learn today. Scarrell back to throw. He's got his man Plumlee caught at the 40, upended there, and he's got the first down. Happy birthday, John Rice. Make you a catch. Scarrell back at quarterback. Quick slant route is going to be caught by Plumley, but he's tackled instantly about a yard shy of the first down. And they're going to go for it. They give us to Parrish, and Parrish off the left side has the first down, down to the five-yard line. How about your quarterback, Matt Corral, leaving with a block there, too? He's going to take the snap, fake to Connor, live in the end zone, wide open, touchdown, Casey Kelly, and the Rebels get six. Let's go. Turn up. Turn up, everyone. So it goes on, Ole Miss still gonna be Ole Miss. He's gonna hand it off right up the gut. There goes Snoop Connor. He's in the 25, the 20, the 15, breaks the tackle, the 10, rolls over a guy and drops to the five yard line. The Rebels are ready again. A handoff to Connor, left side. He jumps in the end zone. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Congratulations. Indiana's number 93, sophomore Kevin Cross. Yes, sir. You ever seen a yacht? I just glide across the water. Do you look like? Do you look like a yacht gliding across the water? Sweet, you know, it's a beautiful day. While the offense at the sideline jumping, the 2021 defense turned the energy up on the field. Tunnel look looking that way, pressured again. It is intercepted, taken away by Ole Miss. And an opportunity for a return for Otis Reese. He coughed it up on the hit, and it's a scramble for the loose ball. Rebels recovery is fumbled, and Ole Miss with a dose of Indiana's own medicine, the takeaway. How happy are they to have Otis Reese? I'm gonna ball up, see some plays yeah. made. Ball need the camera on me. He me, bro. He's my guys, bro. Uh-oh. 2021 gonna be a scary year, man. Uh -oh. All right. All right. Bubble screen near side. Caught by Fillier. Fillier's gonna run up. He loses the ball. It's gonna be on the turf, and it's recovered by the Rebels. Recovered by Ole Miss's Jalen Jordan. <laughs> Got a hand in there. Oh, yeah. Tyler yeah. Knight came in with that right arm. Hey, what TK? I told you. Well, TK, you keep watching them DD, boy. Hey, ain't no cap in my route. I knew this. Hey, with the game, I'm telling you. 
Hey, hey, he real life you, speak boy. that ball. That, get that ball in existence, bro. He right. speak that every day, bro. He live and he live it. Hey, I'm gonna let you know. Right. 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 He next. Yes, sir. He next. Let you know that he next. Despite the efforts from the Land Shark D, the top ten Hoosier offense was not ready to give in. Play action pass. Tuttle wants to throw slant route. He has his man. It's hauled in and caught at the 38. That was a nice grab there. Stevie Scott finds the edge, gets it blocking down the sideline. Scott scampers out of bounds at the 12 yard line. It's a 21 yard run. They'll go Wildcat here. Stevie Scott takes a snap straight ahead over the goal line and in. Touchdown, Indiana on a Wildcat. Well, you, you feel like momentum's kind of shifted a little bit back towards the Indiana sideline, David. Tunnel steps up. Here's Stevie Scott. In an Indiana first down. All right, here we go. Fourth down, the play action. He wants to throw. A flag is down. It's going to be caught near sidelines. First down at the 10-yard line. Wildcat formation with Scott as the quarterback standing at the 7. He ran it in for a touchdown last time. He's going to take this one in as well. Touchdown, Indiana from two yards out. The Indiana's come back to life. The Rebels found themselves in a familiar position. Tied with the game on the line. Needing someone to step up in a major way. Now Corral back, and he has a quick pass to Plumlee. It's going to be caught, but Plumlee's going to be tackled. Here it comes to the slant. Plumlee's got it! He has elite speed. Corral looking for him again. Here he is! Chad Rice Plumlee up the numbers to the outside! And he takes it to the 5! 45-yard catch and run! Well, the Rebels obviously have got it down inside the 5. David, you got to come away with 7. Play action, Corral fires. That is caught in the end zone for an Ole Miss touchdown. Plenty of time for Indiana. They got to get a touchdown of PAT. They'd love to do it with no time on the clock. A lot of confidence in that Indiana offense right now. There's the snap. He's going to hand it off. Running right is Scott. Scott's got room across the 30 to the 33. They're running at will. That's an eight yard pickup. Three minutes to go in regulation. Tuttle crossing route. There's Ellis trying to get all the way across the field. He's got an Indiana first down and a few more into Ole Miss territory on a gain of 18. Under two minutes to go. Here's Fillier on the reception. Hit immediately, taken down. Before getting out of bounds, a timeout will have to use a timeout after a loss of two. 118 remaining. Can the Rebel defense come up with a play? They've not been able to do it in the last two drives. From the 35 of Ole Miss, second and 12. There's the snap, Tuttle back to throw, runs to his right. Nowhere to go. Can't afford to take a sack, and that's what happens to Jack Tuttle. It's a loss of six. Third at St. Pete now for Indiana. From the Rebel 41, a snap to Tuttle. Four-man rush, he's in the pocket. Steps up, fires, far sideline. Got a man. And it's gonna be headed down by Tylen Knight. Fourth okay, down, right here. fourth down and 18 for Indiana from the Ole Miss 41. Hey, Let's go defense! It's the snap to Tuttle, four-man rush. Steps up in the pocket, he's hit, he's in trouble, dumps it downfield, incomplete! And the Ole Miss Rebels will take over! And look like they've got this one in the bag! Man, it's a great start, man. 
Hey, come to the ship, man. Hey, forever well, grateful to be here, man. Hey, let's, hey, we finna go celebrate, man. Oh, it's a uh, Outback Bowl victory, you know. It's it's time to turn up. <laughs> it's a once in a lifetime opportunity, man. We came out here, did our thing, got the dub, bro. It ain't nothing better. Best weather out here. Good breeze, good game, man. I just, I'm just excited. I'm happy. We got the dub. We got the trophy. We got that ring. You know what I'm saying? Come to the ship. You watching it right now? Look, hey, here we go right here. Here we go right here. Come to the ship, man. Yes, sir. Yes, Come sir. on. Come on. We know how to win down here. Bring it. So guess what? We bowl champions now. Now we're gonna start it off right in 2021. Next sir. year. That's sir. championship time. Let's go. Let's go. Oh miss. Great way to start the next season. We're gonna catapult in the next season. 2021, it's dot, dot, dot. Ole Miss football, let's go. I done seen a lot of trophies in my life, but I never seen a trophy that big and glasses. Never. That's a big trophy. We got men and more team in too. That ain't easy, guys. We were out a lot of players, all right, versus a very good team. That team. It was a one score game against Ohio State, won every other game. So I'm really proud of you guys because that was a typical game. We're up 14, things start to go bad, you could have looked the other way. All right, there was a 20 play, 21 play drive against our defense and you rose to the occasion. I have a game ball right here, okay? And this game ball is going to Jeff Levy, who... You guys know what happened, all right? And a lot of people, all right, wouldn't even be here, all right? And gave him the option to not be here. He said, no, stay. said, no, I'm not leaving those guys, all right? That's my family. Yes, I'm gonna be there with them. This game balls to you, man, I love you. Yeah. Probably so. Luminous. Maybe a couple months, but at least tonight. Definitely. Yeah, it was great. First bowl game, going out on top. It's a top 10 team. It's awesome. It's a great game, all around. And uh, I couldn't be any more proud to be a damn old Miss Rebel. High time. I'm going to tell you right now. Me, OT, TK, AJ. My guy gonna get it right. We're gonna come back next year. We're gonna do the same thing. 21 gonna be scary. 21 gonna be scary. Tune in. Same thing. Times two next year. Keep in mind what I'm saying. Same thing. Times two. We're gonna go two times harder for y'all.